when we take photos or videos is to capture those amazing or unique time. Yet sometime in the future, when we look back at it, we cry. The screenshots of our lives can bring memories. Memories we want to forget. Good times turn to bad times. And those terrible moments turn to terrific ones. And I feel like Goodbye Airy embodying that beautifully. It follows a young boy named Utah, and it, it is his birthday. His mother gave him a smartphone so that he could record her last moment of life. And he did. But you see, he wasn't able to complete the bargain. Because he didn't complete. He didn't record her last moment of life. He recorded the lives they had, the wonderful moments, the happiness and moments they had together. He made a movie out of it, but not everyone liked the movie. Everyone laughed at it. Everyone mocked it. And he wanted to die because of that. So he went to the hospital where her mother died. But you see, Eri stopped him. Eri stopped her from killing himself. And she was a big fan of his movie. And he was like, oh, that's nice. And she, well, abducted him, kidnapped him, took him to an abandoned building. So they could watch a movie together. He was like, why am I here? And she said, because, look, I, I like your movie, but I think I, I think it needs to be better. I want to help you make a better movie. So the birth, ah, my bad. they both worked together to make a better movie. And they did. But, you know, within those moments, um, Ari revealed a horrific secret to him that she also has a disease similar to his mother but maybe it's a different disease maybe it's not but you see he was sad and she wanted him to record her last moment of life and so he did he was finally able to record someone's last moment of life even though he wasn't able to do it to his mother he was able to do it to Ari and Ari appreciated that. And I feel like this story is more than dealing with loss. Coping with it. Yeah, it is about that too. But you see, this story is also about how one screenshot of life, one capture of life, can bring you joy, happiness, sadness. You see, this guy was recording lives. Happy moments, sad moments. And he was able to and find joy in those moments of life. He was able to live free and be happy. And this is what the story meant to me. To find joy in those screenshots of life.
with some Harry's. And you can live happily. Like you too. You know?